All right, hello class. Um, just trying to get the camera set up here. Here we go. All right, hello everyone. It's Miss Williams again. Uh, this is our phonics lesson number 130. All right, so what I need you to do right now is I need you to get a piece of notebook paper out and a pencil. And today we're going to talk about putting words in alphabetical order. Now, if you notice, I've written three words here three words here and three words here. Now, we're going to go through these words and put them in alphabetical order. Now we know that when we're putting words in alphabetical order, we look at the first letter. But if you look at the first letter and all three of these words, they all begin with the same letter. So if that's the case, we move to the second letter. But if you look at the second letter in all three of these words, are they the same? Yes, they are. So. If the second letter is all the same, we're going to move to the third letter. So I'm going to underline the third letter in each of these words. And I want you to do that also at home. So our first word is bring, bring. Our second word is bur, oak, broke. And our third word is bur, ave, brave. Now, looking at the third letter on each word, we're going to figure out which letter comes first. Now remember, we're going to start at the beginning of the alphabet with letter A, and we're going to work our way all the way to letter Z if possible. But in this case, it's not going to be needed. All right, so I have an I, I have a letter O, and the letter A. Now out of all three of those letters, which one comes first, I, O, or A? If you answered A, you are correct. So my word that would go first would be the word brave. So that's my first word. Let me draw the one here. There we go. That's my first word. That would be first for alphabetical order. Now I have bring and I have broke. Now looking at the I and the O, which letter comes first, I or O? If you answered I, you are correct. So my second word would be bring. And then that, of course, would make up my third word broke. So it would be brave, bring, broke. Now let's go to the second column here. We have the words s, ave, save. We have the word s, ale, sail. And we have the word s, aim, same. Now, if you notice, S, 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 they're all the same in the first letter. So I'm going to go to my second letter, but once again, they're all the same. So I'm going to move to my third letter. We have a V, an I, and an M. V, I, and M. Now, looking at those three letters, which one is going to come first? The V, the I, or the M? You have a guess? The correct choice is Sail, the word sail, the I would come first. So sail would be my first word. What would be my second word? Save or same? If you answered same, you are correct. Same would be my second, and then save would be third. Okay, now this last column, I'll move over here. We have the word w, ale, whale, w, Ite, white, and wh, n, when. Now, once again, we have w's, they're all the same. So I'm going to move to my second letter in the words, and that's an h, they're all the same. So we're going to move to our third letter. We have an a, an i, and an e. So they're all different, so we can stop there. Now, we have a, i, or e. Looking at these three letters in the words, which word would come first? If you answered whale, you are correct. Whale would be our first word. And then our second word would be when, because the E would come after the A. And then our third word would be white. So once again, when putting words in ABC order, if the first letters are the same, you go to the second letter. If the second letters are all the same, you move to the third letter. 
Okay, so that's what we went over today. Now, uh, go ahead and get your worksheet out for lesson 130, and we will go over that. All right, uh, lesson 130 for your worksheet, you have section one, you need to change the Y to I and add the suffix. So you have three words, um, and then you have the suffix ES. So you need to change the Y to an I and add ES. Then go to the next column. You have three more words. You're going to change the Y to an I and add ED, okay? And then section two, you're going to circle the special sounds, mark the vowels. And then it says put a star beside each compound word. Who remembers what is a compound word? Let's say it all together. A compound word is two words joined together to make one word. Once again, a compound word, let's say it again, is two words joined together to make one word. So that is worksheet 100 number, I'm sorry, worksheet number 130. So go ahead and get to work and I will see you again soon.